Hi guys, welcome to the free automation learning and my name is Chirag and today we are going to discuss how we can set up our real android device to run uh, this automation by using APM tool right so we have to need uh, some requirement or we have to need uh, some setting which we can do on our re uh, real device to run the mobile automation so today I'm going to discuss all these things first thing we need that uh, as I already discussed in my second tutorial that uh, for APM uh, we need to run our device uh, more than 4.2 version right so first requirement we should have our device which should have Android version 4.2 more than 4.2 and after that we need to do some setting or we need to on developer options we need to set a, a USB device uh, debugging option so I will discuss all these things uh, all these points in this video right so today agenda would be set up real Android device to run uh, automation so firstly guys I will give a demo to run uh, the uh, of mobile of mobile automation on android then we will move to the ios devices after that we will move to the window devices so that we can discuss or we can cover one device at a time right and second point is what is a developer options so i will discuss how we can see developer options what is a developer options how where we can get this developer option on our mobile device and then i will discuss what is a usb debugging option and where we get this de usb debugging option what is the advantage of this option then we will run a command to see whether my device is set up successfully to run mobile automation on it or not so all this point we will discuss right so first requirement as i already told you that you should have the android version 4.2 plus version android mobile you should carry with you then we will have to set uh, on this developer options so where we get this developer options i will show you so this is my mo uh, mobile uh, moto g3 and in this you can see there is a developer options right so guys who where i will get this i will get this under setting so let me open again this is my setting button i tap on it and you can see these are developer options display here if somehow you do not see a developer option so you can go to about phone and you have to click about uh, five times on android version so in my case as i am using moto g i uh, tapped on five times on this android version then i could see this android uh, this developer options so you can search about thing uh, about how you can search as stc and moto g has the uh, have to click on this android version uh, five times then we they guys can see this developer options and uh, those guys who do not using this mobile or have another company mobile you can go to google and search how can we see developer option on the company which uh, the mobile which uh, for which company you are carrying right so this is our developer options so what is a developer options basically by default developer option is off in my case i already turned is on so all the developer options all the things which is given by the developer are display here so the so we have we need to turn on this developer option right then uh, when we scroll down then i could see a U usb debugging option so what is a usb debugging basically when i am click on uh, or give the setting or turn on usb debugging i am saying that uh, to my android sdk you can directly access my devices 
so as i already told that apm use ui automator to automate or run our test devices so so that we need to give this access to um, my android sdk so that he, uh, it can access my um, mobile devices right so i need to turn off on as you can see when i click on turn on then there would be a, a pop up comes so i want to click on okay so after clicking okay you can see that my devices is connected successfully to the my uh, this pc right now i need to click uh, or open command prompt and i have to use adb devices here so you can see there would be a no devices come here because my device is not connected properly right now right so i need to connect it properly again and as i clicked it properly again it's uh, it's asking me whether you want to give access this rsa key to this or uh, this system or not so i have to use this system so i should give this uh, click on okay so this is very important uh, pop up you should uh, if you click uh, this uh, uh, on this usb debugging this pop up should come if it does not come then retry and you should click on okay after uh, clicking okay then you then your android sdk can access your uh, device directly and can pass apm command to your devices right so here in my case i am tap okay button as i tapped on okay button now i again open command prompt now i have to see uh, this command uh, this devices attaches to my pc right so i have to write adb devices command so you can see that my device is connected successfully to my laptop or work station or a machine if you do not see these devices or offline or unauthorized, unauthorized so there is some problem so you should have to restart your devices and retry again this process which i already discuss with you and show, shown to you so guys in the next video i am going to discuss about a uh, uh, how we can run a first test script by using um, this ap mobile automation tool so hopefully you clear these things which i already which i discuss in this video if you have any query any suggestion you can mail me or you can write your comments under comment section and uh, if you like this video please click like button and you want to subscribe my channel so that new epm vi uh, video you can see by your notification comes when i will upload so at that case you need to subscribe my channel and for that time bye bye take care